Well, it looks like the ninth district will be a two-horse race this year between Owensboro and Owensboro Catholic. Now, the Red Devils are in the driver's seat right now, owning a perfect 3-0 record in district play. Owensboro begins the new year with a 7-6 record overall. Rod Drake's team went 2-1 in the Owensboro Invitational, which was right before Christmas, then dropped two games last week at the Meyer Holiday Classic down in Bowling Green. Owensboro, you remember, went 19-8 last year, but they lost in the opening round of the district tournament. In fact, the Red Devils haven't won a district tournament game since they won it all, winning the state championship back in 2015. They have plans on changing that this year. I'm a little presence bias. I think we can win the region. I think we're, you know, right there, like I said, we're playing a lot of young people. You know, they made mistakes early, and they're correcting their mistakes. And, you know, like I say, by the time these guys get to, you know, early February, where we need to be, I think we'll be a season team. I think it's, it's not at its peak yet. I mean, we could do a little better, but keep praying hard every practice. It's behind what Coach Drake says, you know, and, you know, just continue to get better. Don't take a step down. We just got to keep on going up. We just feel really good right now where we're at. And we know we got to get better. Or we can be one of the best teams in the state, I feel like. If we just become ready to play. We matured a lot, and we, we got a long way to go, though, and we're going to just keep getting better. Owensboro will be at Owensboro Catholic. That game at the Sports Center Friday night. It should be a dandy. Girls